Hey guys, good afternoon. Welcome back to my vlog. Or welcome to my vlog if it's your first time. Guys, I would appreciate it if you subscribe. And let's get into this vlog. Today is the 12th, so it's vlogmas number 12. Guys, I haven't had breakfast because I'm intermittent fasting. It's 12.33 and I need food now. So, let's turn this over here so you can see it. We got the blender with 24 ounces of water. We got the organic triple wash spinach. So, let's get four cups in there. I'm going to measure it out with my hand. This is about a cup. Two cups. Let's blend that up. Fully mute, guys, so you don't have to listen to this. Okay, so we got two cups blend up. I'm estimating my hand. Common sense, right? What a cup look like. Or I could measure it. <laughs> let's, let's get a measuring cup to be specific. So, this is two cups. See the one cup next to it? This is one cup. The smaller one is one cup. The big one is two cups. So, I'm going to use the larger one and add in the spinach. Stuff it in because the more the better. The more veggies, especially raw veggies, the better. So, stuff it in there. So, we guarantee that we get the two cups. And a little extra doesn't help hurt anybody, you know. So I stuff it all the way in there. So we have one, two, um, already blend up. I'm gonna do another two cups, make it four. And I'm gonna put you on hold again because you don't want to listen to this. We got four cups, cups, cups of spinach, maybe even more. Okay, so that's how you keep healthy, pack the greens in. So I'm gonna add protein powder. Feel light. I don't think I have enough in there. I'm gonna have to go downstairs to the pantry and get another one. That piece of spinach I just dropped in there that was stuck. Well, Lena, of course. There's nothing in there, really. I'm not even going to use a scoop. I'm just going to pour it in. And um, I'll be back. I'm going to the pantry to get another one. Okay, I'm back. I got another one. Two scoops, and there was a little bit in there, so I'm gonna do three scoops. But I'm gonna leave, um, since there was a little bit, um, in the other container, let's leave a little bit of this out about that. So that's three scoops, that's 30. Right now, we have over 30 grams of protein in there, okay. Let's get blueberries. It's important to get blueberries in every day, guys. Try to do that every day. I guess I'm going to do a cup. So I'm going to get my one cup measure. One, one cup of this. One very ripe banana. Very ripe. 
So I'm done with my fruits for the day. That's the only fruits I'll have. I'm trying to lose weight, so I don't want to eat too much fruit. So I feel like I want some grapes though. <laughs> so I don't know. Okay, voila. That's that. Okay, so hold on, I'm gonna turn the blender on. Guys, we forgot something. Can't forget our spirulina. So that we're gonna do one of the tablespoons. More protein. Protein in the spinach, protein in the protein powder, protein in the spirulina. That's the six grams I just put in there from this. Just from this. So you know, this might be 50 grams by the time I finish with everything that's in there. Hold on. Okay, guys. So we got our mixture of um, spirulina, protein powder, blueberries, banana, um, spinach, um, yeah, and water. I think that's it, right? The fruits are spinach. Um, no, um, blueberries, banana, then the veggies. There's a spinach. Then we add the protein powder and spirulina. I think that's it. I think, right? Sometimes I used to add um like a tablespoon of each, like um, flaxseed and um, and I have it here. Flaxseed and hemp seed. So I need to start putting those in too. But here it is, guys. I don't know why I'm pouring it down there. It's really potent. The green is vibrant because the spirulina. Sometimes it even looks black. <laughs> So purple till it's black with the, when I use the um, wild blueberries. So it's cold, but it's not freezing because the banana wasn't frozen. The banana was fresh. Only the blueberry was the only thing, and the spinach was cold, but the blueberries um, was frozen. So it's the right temperature. It's cold outside. I don't want it to be freezing like summertime. So cheers guys i'll see you in a bit let me go have my breakfast oh and yeah i did take some grapes out and wash them these are globe grapes so they have the seeds on the inside they're not the ones without the seeds these are the one we should be eating every now and then i do eat the other one but it's no good for us guys we need to eat the ones with seed the other one is genetically modified this is real grapes so get you some globe, globe grapes cheers this is my first meal it's um well quarter to one. I'm gonna have all the spinach, all the banana, all the blueberries. See you in a bit. Hey guys, welcome back. Guys, I was resting up and doing stuff. I had to take care of some paperwork for my son. And um yeah, so since I have that shake, I haven't had anything except the vitamins. So Time to cook something. I'm gonna make some cabbage. So you know how it goes. First, you take off the dirty parts, all of this, and then you wash it. And you cut it up and you cook it. Nothing much there. I don't know how you guys make yours, but I put very little bit of oil in the pot. You put some, you know, after you cut this up, you put some skelly, some onions and thyme and tomato and um, pepper and all those stuff in the oil. And then you throw your cabbage in with some carrots and season it up with some salt and pepper, a little garlic powder. Ta-da! Got cabbage. Got steamed cabbage. So how do you guys prepare yours? Let me know. Cause that's what I'm about to do. It's gonna be one more of those short, sweet vlog because there's nothing much, guys, going on, you know. But just about to cook some cabbage. That's it. I was on the phone with my daughter and with my good friend Arlene, and um, I did a little sewing and um, yeah, sorting out, sort out some things, you know. So, when I get to some kind of progress, I'll come back and show you. 
Guys, how thin do you cut your cabbage? Because some people cut it big. I like it. Mine shredded, sort of. I like mine like this. How do you cut yours? Comment below. If you just chop it up. Some people cut maybe this in about, you know, in big chunks. I see people cut it with a ham. There's something in kind of, not ham. Um, what, does, what do the Irish do? Corned beef? I think it's corned beef, right? Yeah. So they're kind of, they're not thin like the way I'm cutting it. They're bigger pieces. And then they cook it with the corned beef and potatoes. That's a nice dish. Because I remember, we do the same thing in Jamaica, but we cut it up. We shred it like this, like I just showed you, with corned beef. But we use the canned corned beef. So good with rice, lots of black pepper. All the seasoning I just mentioned, but a little extra black pepper will make it better. Oh, look at the sunlight. I don't know if you saw the sunlight just come out. Wow. I don't know if you just saw. Oh my gosh, it's so, so bright. I have to show this to you guys. Look at that. Look at the window. The sun just came out. Wow. Must be blinding you. <laughs> but that just that just appeared. It just happened. So, yeah. Got the fireplace going. And it's a little dark in here. It's the 13th day. 13th day left. 13th day left. Is it the 13th day? Today is what? The, no. 13th day left. It's the 12th. Yeah, so that's what's going on now and i'll be back show you when i make more progress okay guys so this is the cabbage must be steaming up the camera but there it is it's not finished no, no. not by any means it's not finished um Amazing. I'm mixing it around because if you don't stir it, the bottom will cook and the top will stay raw. You know, it will eventually, but you want it to be cooked all at once. So. Yep, so we've got tomatoes and onion and pepper and carrots that and thyme salt black pepper and some garlic and um yeah it will be done in 30 minutes and i'll be back i'm starving i'm gonna get um a snack i'm gonna get pretzel and hummus and snack and that and then i'll have that for dinner because I only have one meal and it's 4.26. I have that protein shake I made earlier and the grapes. Do I have anything else? Nope. So, yeah, I want some pretzel. So I'm going to get pretzel and sit and finish watching Judge Judy. Um, it's 4.27. And Ju Judge Judy finished at 5. The cabbage will be finished also. And then, um, I'm wondering if I should go upstairs and take my shower. But, um, Rocky is coming. Rocky's our grand puppy, grand dog, he's a dog, and um, he's coming, and he's going to be all over me, so I think I should wait until he comes, and then take my shower. Alrighty, so, I'll be back, let me go downstairs to the pantry and get some pretzel, and I'll be right back. Okay, so, got my big giant bag of pretzel. Oh, I didn't open it yet. Okay, babe. No, I didn't. I think I opened this already. Hungry. something for the uh, pretzel on. Got a plate.
both of the dogs home with you to your stepfather's house. I took the one dog with him. And so that female stayed with you at your stepfather's house. Yes, she did. Until when? Until I had moved out in 2016. So from 2012 to 2016, you had the female. Yes, but I had the male too. A couple of days later, we have some hummus. My pretzel. And a kombucha. As you can hear, Judge Judy is going. I like that, guys. I like Judge Judy. I like it. One. I always have two big spoons. More than the serving. That's like five servings. Okay, guys, I'm going to enjoy my snack. I'll be back. Guys, I have my snack. You know, about 20 minutes have passed or so, half an hour. Train is over there running on the track, but making some funny sound. So the cabbage is done. That's the cabbage. Huge pot. And um, I'm making some corn, potatoes, Irish potato. It's all vegan. Oh, and I'm putting some plantains in the pot. I don't know if you guys ever cook yours like that, but that's how we do it. We cook it in the skin. And when it's finished, then, of course, I washed it and cut them and peeled them. Then when it's finished, you um, take them out of the skin for you eat them. So that's what I'm going to have. I have my little snack. Still have to drink my water. I'm going to drink all of that. Let me show you. Because I'm closing out the vlog. So happy vlogmas. Day number 12. And guys, I just hear in the news that they found 26 shops selling illegal weed in New York City. Selling weed illegally. Don't have a license. You know they can sell it, but they have to get a license. So, there's a train going. The light outside is on. There we go. That's the light outside. We turn off this telly. Fireplace going. So, you know the deal. Saw it before. Nothing new. So I'm here. My husband is on his way home. I'm here sitting in the dark. You know, not really because we have the lights going. But it looks better in the dark when you turn the room light off. So, yeah. Yep, 13 more day days left. You see if you can see the neighbors across the street. Their, their, their yard is like, I don't know if you can see that or my light is reflecting. But yeah, that's what they have going on. That's my little thing out here. That's our little thing, you know? Thingy. So guys, thanks for hanging with me today. And um, I'll see you tomorrow for Vlogmas number 13. So we'll be out of the house tomorrow. I'm still eating pretzel. <laughs> we'll be out of the house tomorrow, guys. We um, have things to do. Can't stay home today. But it was productive. Rough day. Productive day. Yeah, I did some stuff, important stuff. So, come back and mess with me tomorrow. Please subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow.